Hey everybody, it's Bluetooth and welcome back to Splatoon 3. Now that we've completed the story mode, let's head back in. Because why not? Agent 3! Agent 3! I'm so glad you're okay. I mean, I knew you would be. Nicely done. We saw it all. The dal- the, the, the daring. The bravery. The incredible skills. Who knew Small Fry could do all that? Uh, and you were there too. <laughs> yeah, Agent 3 basically saved the planet. Does anyone other than us even realize that? Being a hero, well, it's a real trip. A voyage, if you will. Some kind of tour. Where you- you, you go places. Booyah. Ah, well, said Gramps. Oh, the captain was full of praise for you too. There was a heartfelt nod of approval. Hear, hear. Well, until next time. Stay fresh. Gramps is, uh, still, uh, looking dehydrated. That look in your eye. Yeah, it's still the look I was looking for. Yeah, this ain't so bad, but I missed my tropical shirt. Think I can ever get one in X XD? So what's the plan now? Speak to me. Have you noticed that the walls are meant to look like the sky? Just like the Octarian bases. I did notice that. Also, where's the hole in the sky? There it is. What do you like to do in your spare time when you're not being splattered? Uh, well, let's find out where the new stuff is, because there, 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 there was mention of a new kettle somewhere. But it might not be... obvious? Hang on. Activate shell drone. Oh, that? That's the shell drone. I bet you can guess who designed it. Sheldon, right? Anyway, he said that thing can help find hidden items, even here in Alterna. Well, he said a lot more than that, but you get the gist. One of the important things he said is that you need power eggs to open it or operate it. So if you have extras, maybe give it a try. Yep, and supposedly takes it supposedly takes anything it finds directly back to the lobby. So check out the lobby terminal to pick them up. Once you pick the up the item, the shell drone will return here automatically. Uh, fly free, little shell drone. You know, 999 power eggs is a lot. You sure you want to use those to run the shell drone? It'll search Alterna for goodies to bring bring back. Woo, go to little shell drone, do your thing. You can pick up whatever it finds at the lobby terminal, maybe tomorrow-ish. I'd give it a little time. So I guess this is one way to find anything that's hidden, although I'm pretty sure I have everything, so I don't know how helpful that's going to be. Also, it looks like where we crashed is actually, or where we landed, is where the new kettle is. So let's go take a look at that. After Alterna, reach the goal to gain access to the da 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 log. We need 333 power eggs to enter. I kind of wish that the map on this screen lit up whenever you were, like, in that area, or after you'd completed that area. But anyway, let's go. Let's get this thing started. Well, watch your step. Okay, interesting platforming here. Guess this is a really... This isn't really a design test, except it is, so... Anyway, we also have the best gear now, which is nice. It's been a while. Gotta keep watching your step here. Okay. I don't like the way the waves are moving right now. It's fine, though, because I can't platform anyway. I'm just concerned about water rising or platforms falling. I have that sinking feeling again. <laughs> it's fine. Get rid of you and you. I have to actually make sure I have the m momentum I need to get across these jumps. 
And also probably painting the platform that I'm going to is also probably a good idea. I'm just not sure if it washes off in the water or not. It might not, but I don't know. Uh, the answer is no, it doesn't get washed off. I think. Yeah, it's all good. No, don't need to be concerned that much. Take you out, very nice. Okay, let's keep going. This feels so different for some reason, I don't know why. Okay. So, um... Oh, I guess I just need to hold B, don't I? Like that, and then we go. Nice. Okay. Need a squid surge here, just... Okay. Oh, oh, need to be careful. Be, be careful, be careful, be careful, be careful. Okay. Oh boy, hey, wow. Oh wow. Nope. That's a shame. I didn't see that was happening there. And I couldn't really do anything about that. Oh, we have to go all the way back. No checkpoints. This is Champions Road, isn't it? Okay, we're back to the wall now, but we do need to be careful. Okay, hang on. Go. Go, 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 and jump. Not quite. What are you doing to me? Why? Why? Hang on. Hang on. No, hang on. Go up. Not like that. Oh my gosh. What are you doing to me? Okay. Oh my goodness, we're up. Okay. That was concerning. If this is just a no checkpoints level, then I'd actually prefer to have my... Uh... Lives back and restart completely. Rather than go through this with... Trying not to die at all. Didn't need that, but that's okay. Why this? Why this? Why is this moving? It's fine. Take you out, okay. Staying alive. Hang on, just give me a second to look around. Oh, there's a fair bit left, isn't there? I don't know. It's hard to tell from over here at the moment. Okay, that works. Can kind of squid roll off of the wall. Like that. Okay. Ha, huh, you're showing off. Not really. Also, if there's a boss, I'm gonna be in trouble. Just going down. Yep. Safe, that was close. Oh, hang on. Oh, we have to stay on that. Which we can do like this, I guess. Okay. Just gonna do that. Hang on, that's rude. Don't do that. Oh my gosh. There's more stuff going that way. <laughs> how, is, how is it this long and there are no checkpoints? Okay. I have a bad feeling about this one. We can kind of keep moving, just need to make sure I keep holding the B button though. I'm glad I can keep moving like this. Well, let's jump off of that prematurely to make sure we live. Oh, hello. Okay. How's this so long? Take out you, okay. Oh my gosh. I think we're getting close to the end. <laughs> Maybe? Oh my gosh, the beginning is way over that way. I don't want to die now. That's for sure. Just need to keep in mind that we have to actually move in the direction that it's aimed at, otherwise we won't make it all the way. Okay. Yes, nicely done. Oh, this though. Hang on, that's a 
That's a jump pad. That's not the end. This reminds me a lot of Odyssey. Okay. Oh, this reminds me a lot of Odyssey. Actually, yeah, this reminds me a lot of the darker side. <laughs> this reminds me like of the darker side. Oh, boy. Okay, let's go. No. No. No, no. 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 Okay, I made it back. Oh, my heart is racing now. Might actually be a good idea to spend time inking the other platforms in front of me. So that when they go round, I can reuse them. Which I'm going to have to do at this point. Since I'm not really catching up right now. That was close. Okay, now we can start moving forward. So I can get onto the wall here. Oh my gosh. You made it. Let's see where that, la where that launch pad takes you. Please, checkpoint. For goodness sake, checkpoint. Thank you. Here we go, part two. Oh my goodness. Have to keep getting all the balloons. I'm losing my mind. I'm losing my mind. We can't miss a single balloon. Which basically means this is have, has a time limit. So that's just great. I love time limits. Okay. Good, 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 good. So far. Although I'm expecting this to be long. I need to conserve my ink. And hit everything. Also need to conserve my sanity a little bit. What am I doing? Oh, really? 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 Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. There's so much more left, isn't there? I don't like not being able to see where the balloons are. Okay. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Oh. Oh. Phew, that was so intense. Great job. You're not done yet, but keep it up. Oh my gosh. Insanity. The level. <laughs> Oh no. Another checkpoint though, which is good. Oh, give me a second to breathe. Octosoka blocks. That's just rude. We're gonna have to keep doing this carefully. So let's do that. Really? Okay. Drop that, okay. Do your thing. I don't know if I can really take you out, but okay. Why does that go there? I guess that's just to take out the enemy, but that doesn't need to worry about... Oh, it does also link up to that, okay. No, you, you know there's going to be a, a part of this where it expects you to... have the level sync. Okay, it's all good. Just let the little buddy do his thing. There's gonna be a, there's gonna be a, a sinking feeling part of the level. Take you out before you destroy everything.
Okay. Okay. How do I want to do this? I think I'm going to set you on there. Hold B and move slowly. Okay. Nice. That was nerve-wracking. Indeed. Now what is this? Oh. 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 Need to run. Just gonna ignore you. Just gonna ignore you mostly. Trying to survive here. Okay, up we go. Make jump. Checkpoint. Okay. Oh. Checkpoint. Thank goodness. This really is the dark side, isn't it? That's not what I was trying to do. Oh well. I'll activate that. So I can get around without having to worry about stuff. I'm not even going to check if there's anything over there. Oh boy. I have a sinking feeling. Activate that, maybe? Just for a little bit. Okay. So I guess we need to change blocks now. Or platforms, that one. Which means we want that to move. Oh my gosh. Okay. Just be extra careful, jumping platforms. Okay. All aboard Octo Missile. The end of the stage must be at the last stop. Uh, I didn't see the rest of that. Hang on, what? Hang on, come back. Why? Why? What was the point? I don't, I don't know. Just gonna let, wait for that wall to go away. Because I guess that's what we're doing here now. Um, how am I supposed to survive? Like that, I guess. Oh boy. Good thing we got that checkpoint wherever that was. Wait, what am I doing? That, I guess. Okay, let's go. Okay. Okay, time to move. Hey, can you finally see the last stop? Can you? No, that's another jump. So how am I supposed to do this madness? And not lose my mind? Okay. That works. Okay. Phew, finally. It's very stressful, yes, indeed. What's next? Boss fight? Boss fight. Nope. But it is enemies. There's the end. I guess that is a boss fight. This seems familiar. Is that the go back there? Life, like, way back there? This feels very familiar to me. This feels like Girl Power Station. <laughs> this is this is not gonna end well. Enemies incoming. This does feel like Girl Power Station a lot. Don't let them get too many of them gang up on you because that will be bad. Try to use small fry as best you can. How dare you! Okay, this is why we grab shields. Also, we have the lock-on targeting system thing, which is being helpful right now. Being able to see where they are. Where are they? Did I get them all? 
I don't think so. Where are they? I can hear one. There we go. There you are. Let's get a review. Was all of them, I think? That was the last of them. Maybe. No, it's just changing area. It's just changing the terrain. Can special. What? More of them? Where are you? You're right there, please. Ah! Oh, there goes my first life. I guess I can pay the toll to keep going if I die. So I don't think I'm going to lose any progress from this point, but still, I'm still concerned. Come and get him. Why are they going after him? It feels like they should be. But they don't seem to be. Okay. Take out this one as soon as it drops in. Please. Thank you. Drop you. Ow! I hate how powerful they are when they drop in. Because they can immediately take you out, basically. As soon as they drop. You had a blast. I'm good. Good thing I got rid of you. And you. Okay. Let's grab this special and maybe not use it. Or something. Or maybe if I do use it, I'd use it smartly. Okay, let's use this. Oh, there's an ultra stamp. Nice, little buddy. Oh boy, you have an umbrella. I'm gonna stay away from that bomb. Auto bomb. That was not quite as helpful as I wanted it. It's fine. Just don't die. Take the time to recover. Take the time to recover. Don't go insane. Let's find out what that special is. Take it. This does feel a lot like Girl Power Station. Especially with the specials. Hmm, that was the last of them, right? Come on, even more of them. Wait, why am I worried? You're you, go splat them. Oh boy, that's not good. Oh, they have specials now. Oh boy. Out of the way. Okay, ow. Ow, 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 ow. Stay alive, stay alive, stay alive, stay alive, stay alive. Okay, let's try and use this area as best we can. Oh, they're using the their special stuff. Okay, take you out. Just stay in the clear. Please. Just stay in the clear. Maybe cover some ground to build up my own special. Since I do have a charging special. Which I even upgraded as well, so. Nice. Also want missiles. Oh, 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 oh boy. Okay. Is there just one? I think it's just the one. To cover some ground. Gonna retreat. Just live. You're just rude. Really? He took out my small fry.
This is just so rude. Take you out, okay. Getting out of here. I think we actually got rid of them all. I probably should have just used my tentum missiles. Seriously, you were so fresh out there. Congrats. And there we go. Mission complete. Oh my gosh, good thing there's no time limit. <laughs> good, good thing there's no time limit. That could have been bad if there was a time limit. And then there was no orb to defend either, so that's also good. Man, the orbs. I remember orbs. It was something. You got a new title. Wow. Alternan World Champ. Alternan New World Champ. Nice. I'm definitely going to use that because I have not had enough of those. Oh, nice. Teddy Band. More equipment and stuff rewards from the story mode. I'm so happy that that's a thing. Also, I just realized this is my second account. I have to go through all of that again on my main account. Oh my gosh. Also, is that all of the extra stuff after the end of the story mode? I don't know how to know. I'm going to assume that was everything. But, but just to make sure, I'm going to also jump to the other islands. Yeah, as far as I can tell, that's everything. I only checked the one extra world, but I, I don't think there's anything else. So I guess that is it for now. I guess, although I need to also check. Because I don't think there's actually something to check or watch rewatch the credits. Also, Scramps is still not looking 100%. So I don't know what's happening with the rest of that, but... I wonder if it has something to do with this. Like, I wonder if this is going to open up at some point in the future. I would believe that. But I have no idea, so I guess that is it for now. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Also, up until now, I forgot about the uh, Sunken Scrolls. So if you look on the bottom left, on the other page here, you can see a little drawing of, I think, a sw squid on a swing or something. And if we flick through, you can see it moving. So now I'm going to flick through faster and have it animate a little bit, showing some different characters. Or, you know, you can go through that like that, but that's way faster. I don't like the extra motion controls of the Sunken Scrolls for this though. It really ma makes it difficult to have that animation work properly. But it's cool. I'm glad that that's still a thing. Also, if we go into the menu, apparently for the hero gear, we can actually press minus now to reset it. Which means that it will go back to being completely ungraded. We get to keep all of our Sardinium and upgrade points, but the problem with this is that it takes a long time to re-enable everything. But it means that we can actually set it to whatever we want, except you can only do it as uh, unlock stuff further down the line if you've unlocked the stuff before it, leading to it. So you actually have to follow the skill tree all the way. You can't just skip to the end and like unlock something over here until you've unlocked something connected to that, and something connected to that, and something connected to that. And it has to be actually unlocked, or upgraded. You can't just unlock it and then upgrade the thing after it. So yeah, it's good, and also it's very slow. It's just so slow. But anyway, just wanted to point out that this is here so you can do it. I'm not even sure if I can be bothered spending the time <laughs> to unlock everything like this, just because it's so slow. What, sh what it should be is just like enabling and disabling. But it's just so slow. Anyway, that's there if you want that. Okay, so I'm back again because I want to go to Site 2 and the boss. I'm not sure if there's other stuff that I need to look at, but I forgot about this thing that I wanted to do. So let's head in because we've already fought them, but we never rematched them.
Something tells me Fry hasn't learned her lesson. There's actually more stuff here for us to look at. Just, just in text, but I think it's cool that it's here like this. About time, sheesh. I got a little problem, see? When I got beat, I just can't let it go. Oh, that's right, I almost forgot. You and me, we've got deadly dance moves. Eels, get back out here. Yes, yes, yes. Rematch, baby. Guess the treasure is still here. <laughs> New record. Okay, so let's take a look at the next boss and see what they have to say now that we've already defeated them. And want to rematch them. Pedal to the Megalodon! Psh, that catchphrase could use some work, right Agent 3? Stop where you are! You're back, which can only mean you missed me. How sweet of you coming all this way just to give me a win. Ah, the cold shoulder again. You grow more wicked with every battle. And that's supposed to be my thing. Another lesson. Master Mega. Pedal to the Megalodon. Again! Also, we are much stronger than we were before. It makes these bosses a lot easier having all the upgrades. Which you can't get all of the upgrades until you've defeated them, so it doesn't really matter that much. But it is just nice. Let's fin-ish this. I didn't notice that one last time. Forgot you need to jump to it. Another new record. Even though I died once, because I was pe not paying and as close to the- uh, I was being a bit too reckless and staying up close to the boss, basically. And of course, the best one. Hmm, hmm. The energy in here. He must be back for more. That's the way ca the cat. Well, <laughs> that's what the captain is saying. Anyway. You're back. You want to fight me? Again? Really? Still not a big fan of fighting, but... The other two will get to yell at me if I run away. This could be a good way to get more fish eggs, though, just fighting the bosses again. It's kind of a shame that there aren't more bosses in this. But there we go, that's all of the boss refights with the extra texts in there. I just think it's a cool little small detail that you might not notice unless you refought a boss, which you don't need to, so... But anyway. Okay, I'm back again. Just to point out that the rocket is blue now, when before it was orange. And also, I don't know how to get back to refight the final level and boss, like the boss and final level again. If that's even possible. There's nothing in the kettles to go to it, there's nothing on the map to go to it. There's not even a jump to the extra level after the end of the game anyway, so I don't know. I don't even know if you can rewatch the credits then, but anyway. Also, just as a side note, as a reward for clearing all the kettles in all of the different worlds and doing them, like, to, so for clearing each world, uh, and clearing each, like, each weapon each level, there is, uh, rewards 
on Nintendo Switch Online, uh, on the app, for your phone. So you can go to that and redeem rewards, which are all basically phone wallpapers and stuff like that. But it's cool that you can get that for doing all the extra stuff. Also, I've done this entire game 100% twice now, in one week. So that's pretty good. Anyway, this has been fun, but that is it for now. So if you couldn't tell by now, I'm really good at this getting, remembering everything thing. If we go to the archive, in the Alterna logs, there is a log 7, log.exe. Return of the Mammalians. Recall, for a moment, the first apocalypse that devastated the human race. Those who escaped into the caverns of Alterna were not to, not the sole survivors. There were others who escaped via a giant rocket ship. The Ark Polar, uh, Pol Polaris, launched in the nick of time. This ship was la laden with many of Earth's specimens that had been placed in a cold sleep. The mission was simple. Find another planet to replace the Earth. Considering the circumstances of its launch, the Polaris had a smooth voyage until it reached the edge of the solar system. It was at that point the debris, uh, debris stuck, struck the vessel, damaging its navigation system. The crew was able to turn the ship around and head back toward Earth. But the effort was in vain. There was not enough fuel to attempt a landing. The Ark Polaris drifted aimlessly for 10,000 years. Eons passed. The once stable orbit of the, of the Polaris decayed over time until the ship found itself in the inescapable pull of the Earth's gravity. Re-entry was not kind to its inhabitants. All perished, save one. Bear number three. An experimental subject who had retained consciousness within his cold hibernation. Survived. Survived. For 12,000 years he had dreamed and plotted. Fully awakened, bear number three came to a terrible realization. He had not landed on a new planet at all. He was back on Earth, and yet, it was not an, an Earth he knew. This Earth, it seemed, was dominated by sea creatures, not a single mammal to be found. In the course of his research for even a single fellow mammal, bear number three used navigational equipment from the wreckage of the Ark Polaris to discover Alterna. It was a wasteland, of course, but a few of the liquid crystals that had once covered the walls and ceiling remained. With knowledge built during his thousands of years of, dream of dreaming, he repaired some of Alterna's facilities and began researching the crystals. This research bore, the f bore fruit when Bear number 03 compounded some of the liquid crystals with his own fur. The experiment had created an entirely new substance with one terrifying property. It could, could, it could transform any living creature into a mammal. Bear number 03 realized the implications Im immediately. He could restore the planet to a mammalian paradise. He began stockpiling fuzzy ooze, and he, as he called it within Alterna's still intact rocket. For such a venture, he would require the acquisition of thousands of golden eggs. These were used in the creation of the fuzzy ooze, although the exact details have never been recorded in my memory banks. But band number 03 had a plan. He founded a corporation that would, that would go on to employ locals to collect his golden eggs under the name Grizzco Industries. Mr. Grizz, as he was now known, would pay handsomely for them. With Fuzzy Ooze production peaking thanks to the assistance of unsuspecting inklings and octolings, Mr. Grizz took the final steps to set his plan in motion. The rocket was loaded. It wouldn't be long now. I'm glad that I saw that that was there, because I would not have noticed that that was there if I wasn't going through menus a lot looking at other stuff. But there's a little bit of the story of Mr. Grizz and how he became the monster that he became. Have a little bit of sympathy for him, but not really considering what he was going to do. 
But anyway, that should be everything now, hopefully. <laughs> if not, I'll be back in a second.